shortly before I made my black belt in uh, mid-1973, uh, Bob Wall, who was uh, the person responsible for me being in karate, was uh, honored by a black belt magazine cover shoot possibility, and he needed uh, somebody to help him with it, so he came to me at the Sherman Oaks Karate Studio and he said, hey Dennis, I need somebody to be in Black Belt Magazine with me, would you do it? And I said, sure, I'd do it. I jumped at the chance. So he, they came, he came to the studio, a photographer and, an, and a reporter came to the studio too. And I was talking with the reporter and Bob Wall was standing there in a fighting stance and he was explaining how he threw his jab, because that was his famous sparring technique, his jab. So we were standing in a fighting stance, me with my right foot in front, he with left leg in front. And the photographer, reporter, asked me a question. I asked him a question, so we turned. I turned to look at the reporter, and before I knew it, boom, I was getting hit in the face, right here, with Bob Wall's jab. He was throwing his jab as I looked over there. And my eye started to swell up like this. We put some ice on it, and we were fine. Then the photographer says, okay, we want to go to a local park and shoot a picture, an action shot of Bob Wall doing a kick. So we went to Van Nuys Park. By that time, my eye had Basically, the swelling went down a little bit. You can't see it in the cover of Black Belt Magazine, but I, my eye is a little bit swollen because my head is turned this way. We went to the park, and Bob Wall did a flying sidekick, and the photographer looked at me, and I looked at him, and we both decided that Bob Wall needed work on his flying sidekick, but that's the kick he wanted to throw. So he, he a black belt, asked me, a red belt, my advice on how he could make his flying sidekick better. <laughs> Naturally, I was flattered. So I told him to jump up as high as he could and kick downwards towards me. That way he'd look better on his flying side. So I got down in a very low crouch fighting stance and the photographer was lying down behind me. So he shot up to make Bob Ball look like he was jumping higher. So the cover photo that you see in Black Belt Magazine that was uh, published in January of 1974 looks like he was way up in the air and it looks like he was kicking me because my, my head was turned to the side. So I turned my head just as his kick came by and no, he didn't kick me, but it was very close. And that was uh, my claim to fame as a red belt being kicked out by Bob Wall and a flying side kick. What's going on everyone? Thank you so much for watching this story. We're gonna be doing the tutorial next week, so please make sure you tune in for that. If you have any questions or if you have anything you wanna see, let us know. Please click the like button. Give us a little bit of a thumbs up. Hey, do you see these videos over here? They could be your friend. You just wanna click that subscribe button right over here. Just this little, this little guy right here. Should be, a, should be one of these. Should be somewhere around here. Go find it.